Well, so much for lawn care today. Can't do the lawn, can't make a video. Sorry. It's pouring outside. So since I'm not making a video today, because normally I cut and do all the lawn stuff and then edit it all and put it all in the same day, uh, we had a downpour and I can't do anything. So this is what happens when it rains. Really bad. So I'll show you guys what I have to do and I'll show you guys the lawn what happens. But first we got to get this little thing right here out into the sewer and then get all the appropriate tools. This is uh, my life living on the water. So I'll show you guys uh, what I do since I'm not making a video. Let's drag this thing all the way around. It's, it's like the lake. It's here. And I got this little manhole here plugged up. And then do is drop that in there. And then if you look behind me, that goes all the way to the lake and all the water out into the lake don't worry I don't spray anything over here because all that water I don't want it to go into the lake so this is really just untreated and I don't take care of it up here because there's no grass so let me get this all set up and show you so we got that bin all this hose we got 230 feet of hose and then drag this across the lawn the lawn looks pretty uh pretty green we got uh, a few things going on though show you had some weird grass growing over there. I'm experimenting with tenacity, really uh, laying it on thick. And then uh, over here, testing uh, along my neighbor's property. Over there, over there is uh, nuts edge and stuff. So just trying tenacity out on it, seeing what it can really do. But over here, as you can see, this is all standing water and this pump goes out into the lake and all of this attempts to drain loose like crazy right now. It just won't stop. But I didn't have that last year. Have stuff sitting out on their back. There it goes. Just slowly pumping. So that's not the seawall. The seawall is below that. So the water goes past that and you can't really see inside those cracks but the water is up against my barrier that I built here and no matter what it's still going to come through and as you can see I can't even mow I have to weed whack that and it smells like shit let me tell you when you go through it I made that this is part of a dock but then over here see we're still soaked it starts getting dry right here but, uh, yeah, I was going to do a shortcut, long cut, explain some things, but uh, it's not happening. So let's drain this. So flowers are drooping. Got a pretty hard rain, but check this out. What is that? These are dahlias. I don't know what kind. They were just on a shelf at the place, and I bought them for like $5.99 or something. I think it was open product, but I know they're supposed to be spaced out, so... Rob's helped me from turf therapy. You're the man. And uh, we might try and transplant, but man, how thick these things are. Dahlias are crazy. I don't know. But I know they're not supposed to be that close. All right. I don't know what to do with those. I don't know. But uh, let's go to the garage. All right. Let's get in here and do a little kick. It's a little feature that we have at the house. Pick it twice and you uh, see a little prayer and it opens. Just kidding. All right. This is what we need. I got a bunch of stuff going on in here though. Like over here, that right there, those are products that were given to me from people online that think that they know or think that I know what I'm doing all the time. I don't know, but they're giving me stuff which I appreciate. That right there is a table that was damaged. If you look, there's a tiny little crack in it, and that thing's 70 bucks. Ace Hardware gave it to me for free. So I'm gonna do those unboxings on that table because all that stuff is free. All of it, awesome. But uh, this is our Harbor Freight Predator. So, start trash pump. 
Harbor Freight Predator. Just uh, got done filling it up with the sure can. I don't know, having the five gallon sure can is pretty cool, but uh, man, when you lift that sucker up and you gotta hold it, it sucks. I wish I would've bought the smaller one. But you can also just fill it up halfway, but then what's the point of filling it up halfway? You should just buy a smaller gas can. But uh, I'm gonna have to put the phone down so I can lift this thing and place it right in its spot. Gotta get thing to hold the water so I can prime the machine, but long pusher, go follow him on Instagram. This guy put up this thing. This is awesome to put wherever. And this one actually is a combo has a light on it so I don't even the keys got that what do you think about that there Mr. Long Pusher but now we get this we fill it up with water pour it inside the machine so it can pump it pour the water a little hole there People say Harbor Freight stuff sucks. Well, you suck if you think that. So, all right, let's see if this thing starts. All right, chokes on. One handed pull. That's right, Harbor Freight rocks. And now, pinch it here. It helps get pressure and build up. And there it goes. Try and get a handle on this fire hose. Wonder if uh, maybe maybe I should call up uh, Justin from the uh, Lawn Whisperer. He can, he can handle this bad boy. I don't know if he can handle a gauge that thick though. What? That's what she said. All right. And now this is what we do. Now I go back up to the street and I just watch it and try to uh, make sure it doesn't get clogged. You see the line where it was and look at all these people. Don't they know it's a no wake zone? Look at this. Kids texting. It's a residential. No wake. These people. It's terrible. It's millennials. I'm just kidding. I'm a millennial. <laughs> See, we run into this problem right here. It's not, there's no action going because this thing, it's covered. So now, this is just like all the nasty crap that's like, a, I mean, it's a sewer, sewer drain. Everything goes in it. Probably should wear gloves, but, you know, I'm not a wimp, you know. And now kind of place it in there and try and hover it just above the pile of leaves that's down there and then it starts sucking again. This is uh, the Neighbor Dominator Studios or Long Care 101. Go check it out, YouTube, subscribe to that, but. Yeah, it's all products, Simple Lawn Solutions hooks me up, not sponsored. And then all my sprayers, old Simple Lawn Solutions. We even got some of this, uh, Lawn Star crap and uh, T Nex. This can't stop crap, it's okay. Sunday, there's the Zoxy Strobin, Propaconazole, some of that 0026, and then all my tank sprayers. Got the Tenacity in there, we're already mixed up. That one's empty, my battery powered one. That one has the fungicides in it. That one has a weed killer in it. Then I got more granulars in those cases. I got all my different types of iron that I like to try out. Got some gypsum over there that I gotta put down. Was gonna go to college for golf. Had a partial scholarship, but I used to be awesome, no big deal. My real mower that I started out with, that, and I had a, a hyper tough one. And then of course we got the Father's Day gift right there. Things. It's a bad boy. And then of course, the Allen, which is king. Hopefully uh, Striper Man gets that thing. And for those of you that don't know, that little guy hiding in the corner there, it's the Jet Pizza Man. I'm a pizza guy. I don't know if you didn't know that, but. What's up? Jet's Pizza Masks. Yeah, I got them. No one else does. Not a big deal. Holy 
said it was going to be done, but uh, it's raining again. These guys are black. This is all basically for nothing. At least it's not into the garage anymore. But uh, it's starting to uh, now the storm's passed. We're still pumping, but this is what happens to my yard, and now I can't cut for a long time. deep in there this whole area you can't stand in all right everything's pumped out we got almost three inches of water during these storms here in the past I don't know six to seven hours water starting to go down over here it was standing it's still it's still there so I shouldn't have to water my lawn for Jeez, it's like one to two inches per week. Should be good for like two weeks, right? But uh, yeah, the uh, street will clear out and uh, then everyone else's water pools in into my driveway and then I gotta do it again. So take a look at it. This was empty about 30, 40 minutes ago, but everyone else's comes down my driveway and yeah. So it just keeps filling up. So I leave this whole setup and give it about a couple hours, let it all drain again, then I pump it again. So all right, there it is. Hopefully you guys uh, like this video and make sure you subscribe. Follow me on Instagram. I already got this on my story. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.